Hello, Mark. This is uh, Randy Mack. Anyways, um, just some suggestions for Easy Discuss 3.0 to make it uh, extremely powerful for different uses and that. One of the most popular things that I find uh, is the ability to document um, uh, geography and hiking trails and uh, city locations and everything. Uh, it's a vast audience of people all around the world. There's a number of uh, companies trying to attempt this, TripAdvisor and everything, and the ability to do this is really powerful. Anyways, currently right now, the user interface is awesome. But uh, for 3.0, just some additions uh, that could be added at the top of the screen. Uh, so when you add a discussion, um, put a new discussion in, uh, there would be a feature that would be a check mark here. So I'm just going to, I mocked up an interface and I'm just going to show you the interface. So in the interface, if uh, the person checked off add trip information, then what would happen is the, this information here would drop down and show. So this is the duration in hours, and so what someone would do is just select uh, anywhere from one all the way up to eight hours plus. The difficulty level would be easy, moderate, hard, or extreme. And so that's uh, pretty straightforward. If they select on moderate, that's what it would select. The trip, uh, rate this trip, and so it's uh, one to five stars. And then you already have the auto-detect uh, mapping capabilities built into Easy Discuss. Uh, and I mentioned before in another thread about adding the mapping capabilities to an easy discuss uh, discussion or so the lo uh, location of this trip. And so you could enter in the address of the location or the latitude and longitude or auto detect it. Then obviously your pretty standard stuff with your editor where you could add in your text and then you could add in a poll and then uh, creating your tags, uploading attachments and that. This makes it extremely powerful for a vast audience, uh, people all around the world. Um, people like to document things, especially uh, city locations and trips. And so the uh, interface that uh, would be the result of it uh, when the trip is created, then what it would have is it would have, uh, you know, the title at the top and then it would have uh, the trip duration the difficulty level and the rating. So that could be above or it could be um, below in this area, but uh, it probably makes more sense to add it uh, in here so that people can see it right away. Then you can do the regular stuff with voting. They've added the map uh, into it and so the map could be placed here or it could be placed at the bottom of the screen. And then if they have a poll, the poll could be at the bottom. So what this allows for is it allows for uh, many uses of uh, easy discuss beyond uh, what it currently is right now. And so back to the interface on that, again, just to summarize, uh, you pick your category and then um, if this isn't chosen, it would just do the regular easy discuss. But if this is chosen, then what it would do is it would show um, these uh, basic uh, trip information features and that, that you could add into it. And um, that's uh, just uh, a user interface idea for Easy Discuss 3.0. This is something that I've dreamed of and uh, really would like to see. And, you know, obviously I'd pay extra money for this for sure uh, to see these capabilities built into Easy Discuss. Anyways, uh, thank you for, you know, taking this into consideration, this Randy Mack.